going on guys Dizzy Aaron here and we are back playing some life in the woods too that's right guys we are back and do you guys are you guys enjoying look look at my freaking backpack and I've figured out a couple of cool new things about my backpack go on see something cool guys want to see something cool well, oh you guys are looking at me Guys, want to see something cool all right so let's pull out uh what is what is you all right right there See my little um, excavator I got in my hand? Check this out. Wait, wait, you guys need to see the back. Excavator in my hand, right? If I hold shift, dun dun dun. Now I got my obsidian shovel. Hold shift, dun 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 dun. Tell me how freaking cool is that? So what I'm doing is I'm holding shift and with my uh, mouse wheel, I'm just scrolling through all of my tools that can fit in my backpack. Now, mind you, this only works with the tools that fit inside of your backpack. So these tools that can go in, anything that can go in here, um, you can scroll through it. So if I go to this, I can scroll through all the three tools. How freaking cool is that? Amazing, amazing, I know, I know. Now, check this out, guys. So you notice how my adventure stuff, um, I enchanted it, right? But now look, look, I'm not all shiny and pink. Oh, yeah, so I went on this mission, right? Went on a mission because I did not like the way that the enchanting stuff uh, makes you look. So I tried to figure out a way that I could have enchanted stuff without it making me all nice and shiny and pink. Um, so there is actually, I found a mod. It is called, uh, da, 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 where are you? Who makes it? It's, I just installed it too. Ah, cosmetic armor. There you go. So I just skipped it. Uh, uh, uh. Where are you? It should be right here. Okay, here you go. So cosmetic armor. All right. Now it doesn't add anything except for this right here: skin boots, skin chest plate, skin leggings, and skin helmet. All right. And they're super easy to craft. Like you just leather, and then boom, leather, and then boom. The same thing for all of them. Right. So super easy. Super easy to make. Now. One uh, one thing that it does do, um, it gives you a new little menu. So if you hit the C key on your keyboard, it brings up this menu, which looks like your armor menu. But if you notice on this side, I have adventure suit, skin boots, and my fedora, right? Now, what happens if I take the skin boots off? Oh, look, now I'm all shiny with my boots. So what this mod allows you to do if I was so inclined, I grab my skin stuff, put my skin stuff on. So I grab my skin hat, skin chest plate, and skin boots. Now look at me. Look at me. It looks like I'm not wearing anything. But you guys all know that I'm still wearing my backpack, still wearing all my armor. So basically what this does is um, you can put on whatever armor you want. So if I had all diamond right here. I can put on diamond and then on this side um, for cosmetic reasons you can put on whatever you want so you can put on is that it? But, huh? but? okay I don't know oh yeah I was wearing a pair um, you could put on whatever you want so if I wanted gold armor um, I could put on gold armor and it would look like I'm running around wearing gold armor when in reality it's all diamond does that make sense I hope that makes sense I really do um, but that's just a little workaround um, so you don't like if you Let's just say you don't like the enchanted look like me. I don't like that look. It just it doesn't sit well with me. Just put it that way. Um, so because I don't like it, I want to be able to rock whatever armor I want, um, but still have the functionality of the, the armor. So that's a good little workaround. Now, 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 returning back to our little base here, right? Um, so yeah, I figured out how to get back into bed without having to take off my little sojourner sash because you know how every time I go to bed I always have to take this damn thing off yeah just put the little stair that was right here move it back one block and look voila. so let's go to sleep so I can go show you guys outside because outside we got some pretty cool new stuff that you guys need to go check out and I'm kind of excited to show you guys so let's head on out first of all oh wow it's so nice outside and there's trees yeah, there's trees. I planted some trees. Um, I also started on our little farm stuff. Because you guys remember how I had all this flax stuff, right? 
So I have all the flex in the world. Look at that. Oh man, don't give a flex. And if I switch this out, no more wood. Wood just did not fit. Um, so I switched it out for stone. And if we go down to the very, very bottom, check it out. We got some little bitty crops growing here. How cool is that? We got some soybeans growing up. Oh, ouch. Who are you, sir? Who are you? Let's hit you with it. Get, 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 get. Oh, what? All right. So now, back to this. So we got ourselves some soybeans. And then we got ourselves some tomatoes. Some lettuce. And then over here we have our bread stuffs. Wheat. Some more lettuce. And some tomatoes. Um, I'm planning on making us some very, very vegan burgers. Yes. Yes, you heard me right. Uh, on this side we have corn. We got some more soy. Uh, some celery. And some other beets and stuffs. Just stuff that I found along the way. Uh, we got some pumpkins and some melons. So, yeah. Uh, onions. Lettuce. Bell peppers. So, I'm going to decorate this up a little bit. Uh, one of you guys made a recommendation. Uh, I think it's Bob Bob. Now, I think your name was Kyle. I think that's what your name was. Um, he said, add micro blocks to the pack. Amazing idea. No one brought it to my attention. Unfortunately, haven't added that quite yet. But I think I'm going to add it um, just for the simple fact that I want to change the look of the walls without changing the floor. So I think um, I could do it with carpenter blocks. Like I could switch out carpenter blocks on all this and then just set the block to grass or something and then decide to a different block. I think I can do it that way. Um, but most likely I will add the micro blocks because it's pretty cool and I want some micro blocks. So uh, yeah, that might be a thing here pretty soon. Uh, so yeah, this right here, you guys are probably wondering, hey, Dizzy, how, how, are you, how are you doing that? How are you, how are you getting that to float like a soul? Right? Well, this is still part of the crafting pillars thing. It's just a showcase block. Now, the way you craft that up is just an item frame and your base pillar, which is just stone. Just some stone. And it gives you this really cool look. And if you don't like the name on top, just right click it or left click it or right click it. It's one of these. Shift right click? No, that brings it back. Okay, I swear. You, okay, so you right click the base. Just right click the base and it turns it off. But it's a cool way to store your stuff. So that way you don't have to put a chest right here. Because the only reason I have my hose here is just so I can pick them up. I said, pick them up and then go use them. And then internet, come back and then place it right there. So you just right click and it floats. Now, you guys probably saw this, a compost bin. And wondering what the hell a compost bin is for, right? So that, ladies and gentlemen, is what we're doing today. We're getting back into that garden, um, garden, garden containers mod. I think that's what it is. Is that what it is? I think that's what it is. We tried this one time, right? Uh, where are you? Garden trees, garden core, garden containers. Yeah. So as part of garden containers, it has garden core, which is kind of why I installed the mod, um, and garden trees. Now we're going to play around with pretty much everything in the pack. Um, so this is going to be one of it. So if you build the compost bin, which is super simple, just some sticks and some slabs, whatever slabs you want to use, it makes a little, um, compost bin right now you just right click it and then it's gonna it's kind of i don't know what you would consider this kind of like a furnace no oh. if you if you don't know what a compost bin is like for some of you that live in the city and have never been out in the woods a compost bin ladies and gentlemen is where you throw all of your plants uh your food food trash stuffs uh your dog poop maybe cat poop whatever you got hamsters i don't know what you got what you got <laughs> whatever you got you just throw it inside of a big pile and then you let it rot right sounds gross sounds pretty gross sounds gross to me but if you do that and then you just switch it you mix it around a little bit it gives you some compost right in in this case it turns into enriched soil but in real life it turns into compost or yeah some compost and dirt with like worms and stuff that's really 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 good for your food uh, so I'm guessing, my guess is that this is going to be just as good for our food. So we're going to play with it. So right now I just have some compost. I threw in a bunch of saplings because I had tons of saplings and I planted up these jungle trees, guys. Look at my jungle woods. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, it's pretty dark in there. Um, now for the reason I wanted some vines, some of these little guys right here. 
And then if you use the machete, you can get them really easy. So let's just climb up here real quick. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Feels amazing just to be able to run through here. Just cut all these vines. Any? Yeah, I just wanted a couple of vines just for decoration stuff that I'm gonna do later. On. Oh, where did I just get hops and grapes from? I don't know. I don't know, but I did. So, wait, am I? I think I'm getting it from this stuff. I might be going crazy. Um, ow. Okay, I don't know where I'm getting it from. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, wait, wait a second. I am getting it from there. Oh, that's cool. Good. That would have been good like 10 episodes ago when I was really, 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 really looking for them. But hey, okay, I am not going to complain now. Okay, so I, I'm gonna do the, keep doing this over and over and over for now. Um, I'm gonna start cutting it down because I like cutting these down. Ready? Wait for it. Wait for it. And... <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that is like the most rewarding thing when you just have this stupid little tree cutter mod on and then you go up to the, one of these huge trees and boom, look at that. Wow, that is so much wood. Does anybody want to guess how much wood I have in my inventory right now? If you get it right, you'll get a present. Go down in the comments right now. Leave it, leave it. Let me know what it is. And you got five seconds, four, three, two, one, and look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, almost seven stacks. How freaking cool is that? All right, oh, look behind me. You guys see this? See that? The little trees, the little apple trees? Yeah, I found those. I found these when I was exploring. You know why I was exploring? Um, because I got mad. Yeah, I got mad because I was in my little thing over there doing my stuffs and things, and then I got killed. So, um,. I just took off running and running and let me see if I have my little um, atlas with me because I will show you guys how far I ran so let's go there I am right there right here's our house and I took off running this way and I took all these little things are cool stuff to go visit so if you see one and you want to go visit it we'll go visit we'll probably go visit this one right now because there's so much cool stuff over here so I started running and running and running and exploring and running Look at this, another brick trap. That sounds pretty dangerous. And then I started running up because there was um, water. And then I found trees and I started getting all the fruits in the whole world. And I started running and running. And basically, look, just look how freaking far I ran. Yeah, I did a lot, a lot of exploring, like tons. And then we were right back pretty much. So yeah, I, I did all kinds of exploring. Now, lucky for me, this adventurer's backpack is amazing because when you place it down at night, you get a bed. Remember, on the back of our sleeping bag, or, or on the back, there's a little sleeping bag. So now we get a sleeping bag with this. So it's perfect for exploring. And I'm going to show you guys all of the freaking cool stuff that we just got after after we go build the, some, some garden core stuff. Because the whole point of this we're supposed to be building garden core stuff so all right let's just toss that in there real quick we'll put that guy in there and that and not the vines because we need the vines for later i'm not gonna tell you what but you can guess you win something not really <laughs> all right so let's go put this stuff away uh fruits and vegetables yeah i i thought i had a lot more um vegetables i don't i really don't i need to I need to start storing up all my vegetables because uh, yeah, I don't really don't have that many. And if we're gonna be doing all kinds of food stuffs, we need we need foods. All right, so let's just get into this. So for this, uh, I guess we need a trowel, uh, maybe. Okay, let's build it. Let's get a trowel out. Um, here, let me put this stuff away. That goes there, and you go in here. All right, so let's get one of those guys and one of these guys. Now, um, somebody mentioned. Now, I'm pretty sure this person, I'm not going to say name names, you know, I'm not going to name names, but um, they said that this video, um, it's a little slow, you know, some, it's a lot of filler stuff. She took it or he took it. I'm like, I'm sorry, forget if you're a guy or girl, but I'm assuming they, they ran across my life in the woods and found it a little slow because as you guys know, this is just our little time. We come hang out, chill, do some um, gardening, 
and crafting and whatnot. And I don't think they knew that. But yeah, if you're new to the series, yeah, this is not a crazy modded series. This is Life in the Woods. Life in the Woods is pretty slow. Uh, we like to take our time, explore, do a lot of exploring actually. Um, and so we really don't take this, um, even though it's modded, we have lots of mods. Yes, we have tons of mods. We have over a hundred mods, right? But we take this slow. We, we like to just chill. So if you're new, welcome, welcome. Um, we're glad you're here hanging out with us today. But um, yeah, if you're expecting us to go and, you know, be all Minecraft, yeah, not gonna happen. We take our time. <laughs> In case you guys are wondering. Uh, yeah, and my Batania stuff, it moved. It moved all by itself. No, I'm just kidding. I'll show you guys where the Batania stuff got moved to. It went outside, actually. Um, because I, it's, yeah, the, I wasn't feeling it in here. I really wasn't. So, uh, we decided to move it outside. Also, uh, since, yeah, what I was saying was, I, I did have a lot of new, uh, subscribers. Um, come and join our, I think it's because of Life in the Woods. I'm not quite sure. I do know I got a lot of people from my Direwolf series because I did some crazy stuff on there. Uh, but I think um, some of you guys joined because you saw me on a YouTuber's channel called uh, Forever Player, I think. Um, and if you guys want to know, uh, let's see if I can say this right. Eu no fala portugues. Yeah, I think so. Uh, hablo espanol, pero no, no. Eu no fala portugues. Yeah. But I'm learning, I'm trying to learn. So uh, if you guys want, go leave comments in Portuguese because uh, that'd be amazing. And everybody else uh, will have to try to figure out what that means. <laughs> that, that would be pretty fun. All right, so yeah, just a little side rant there because I got a lot of people um, that didn't know me and I was commenting on a YouTuber's um, series, Portuguese or Brazilian, Brazilian, um, YouTuber and I'm um, yeah I'm not, I'm not the best at Brazilian Portuguese I speak Spanish fluently so yeah that um, all right so what, what else were we doing yeah we're we're crafting up garden soil that that was the whole point of this so I'm gonna make some garden soil I don't know I've never tried this stuff out so I don't really know how good that stuff is um, but I'm just crafting up all this stuff so like this pine sapling and this tall birch so let's get some how many did we make? We made three. Okay, so let's do three and three. Yeah. All right. So let's do three of those guys. Wait. How 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 did we just do that? Enriched soil next to a spruce gives us that. Yeah, that's what we just did. No. Let's just. Hey. Oh, you're on the floor. Okay, give me give me. All right. So let's just try this one more time. So we had a uh, spruce. And next to oh there we go okay and then we got our swamp and now we need our tall birch all right so we're gonna go plant these guys up mm, dark outside oh you guys want to see the backpack thing tell me how freaking cool the backpack thing is watch uh let's go outside just so you can see so when we go outside and we're adventuring we're like oh man we gotta adventure oh it's getting dark oh it's so dark oh man we gotta figure out how to do this well just grab your backpack plop it on the floor like so and then see it makes a little light that's cool huh anyways you can see this button right here click it boom our sleeping bag get inside it and now we're sleeping yeah and then you're done just hit it and then grab your backpack again if you hold shift and you beat it up it goes right back onto you if you just knock it if you just punch it to death uh, then it goes into your inventory so easy way to pick it up all right so let's go plant these guys up and then wait, hold on. Let's before we go outside. Let's see if we need anything else. Uh, I don't think so. I think that's all the stuff we needed to craft up. So we got this, the trowel, and then we got our garden soil and the two trees. So I think we're good. All right, I think we are good. Let me grab up some flowers real quick because I want to try this stuff out. So yeah, that looks good. That looks good. All right, let's go outside. So we're gonna try all this stuff out. Um, First, let's plant our trees, and I think this little area right here, oh, new flower, new flower, gimme. Okay, so I think this area in over here um, is gonna be our tree area. So let's just plop down 
all of our trees. So we got um, pine, pine, yes. Let's put our pine one there. And then let's just go over here, put another pine there. And let's go over here and one more pine there. That looks good. It's not in order or anything, but that'll work. All right, so we'll just put those guys there. And then over here, we'll put our birch. Dun, dun, dun. And then our swamp trees. Uh, swamp trees need to go by water, so. Well, they don't have to, but I think they would look cool if they went by water. All right, so we'll just wait for those little guys. And now, where, where's our trial? Here's our trial. All right, so I think, I'm not sure. Hmm. Hmm. Um, I'm trying to think if it requires our garden soil or not. For now, we'll use our garden soil. Trial? There we go. Okay, so you do. Uh, let's zerk. No, it doesn't work on there. Okay, so you have to do it on garden soil, but if you right click it with your little, see my little trowel? So right click it and then you can do like so. Check that out. So we just put three flowers inside one little box. So if we were to do this, check that out. You can put tons of little flowers all in one little area. How freaking cool is that? So we'll put that guy there, and then we'll put this guy here. Um, I think I'm doing it right. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> We're going to find out if I did this right. I, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just plopping them down. Okay, the, the cool... I don't like this. Big ones don't belong out there. Okay, so I guess the cool part about this, um, I don't know how cool this is, or if this is even cool to you guys, but... We're gonna find out how cool this is. The, you're supposed to be able to arrange, holy shit. That looks like a clusterfuck. Uh, I don't know which one the big one is. I think this is the, yeah, those are the big ones. I thought they was little though. Okay, so let me take this out and that out. Okay, so you're supposed to be able to put them all down like that. See, in a nice little pattern. Um, I don't know how you do this. Well, you guys can figure it out with me. And I don't know what goes in there. More? Whoa. Well, hello there, dirt pile. So I don't even know what that is right there. Okay, so let's just find out what... Oh, more. So you can just shove flowers on flowers on flowers. And it makes this really super colorful fucking clusterfuck of stuff. Oh, yeah. That looks good to me. I like it. I, I think I like it. Yeah, maybe not so well. Hold on, I'm, I'm just seeing what happens if I do that. Okay, so if I do this. Oh, okay, so you can fit five flowers in there and one in the middle. So one big ass flower in the side. Let's take that out. Let's see. Oh, okay. Not bad. So, all right. We'll leave that in that for now, now that we know what that does. And then we'll probably end up putting that in front of our house because if you look, we don't have a whole lot of decorations out front. Yeah. Uh, it would be cool like to have a little f uh, flower gardens on the side so I might do that we might put you know what let's do that how about we just do that now before we forget because I know you guys you guys always seem to forget and then I remind you guys and you guys get all mad so let's just plop those guys down for now um, and then where's our trail let's wait yeah you need the trail so with the trail let's do roses in the middle so a big rose in the middle like it so and then we'll put little yellow flowers on the outside there we go oh, I look so pretty look at that hey eh, it'll do it'll do all right so what do you guys think what do you guys think check it out check it out uh -huh. you guys like that you guys like that all right I think so I think so all right so real quick I want to show you guys where botanical stuff went and then uh I might, might, might be doing something else. So uh, let's just go take a trip over to our Britannia area. It got moved uh, because remember I told you that we're going to be working on this. You guys haven't seen it yet, but I told you guys. This is our mine shaft. This is where we're going to go mining. So I need to build a mine cart and then we can go in there. Um, but yeah, that's next episode. So if you guys want to see the, the mine shaft, that's going to be down there. Uh, but our Britannia stuff is all the way over here. Check it out. So I moved it all 
So here's all the Batanias. Any Batanias you could ever want, it's all right here. So I just liked it up here better than inside the house because I don't like being inside the house. I mean, it's fun and it's cool, but look at it. Look how cool it is. Like you can come over here, work on Batanias out in the sun. It's so pretty. And you can just do all kinds of fun stuff. See? Now we don't have to be inside. Because I know, I know how much you guys hate being inside, right? And then we can just come over here. I'm going to go grab some more materials. Um, like that. The What's it called? Our jungle. We're going to destroy the jungle and bring the wood over here. So that way we can make some more of this living wood and living rock and all that fun stuff. But yeah. So I thought this was a better area for it. And our little flowers. They're all happy over here. Look at this. They're just making all the manas. So we got, let's see how much mana we got. Oh, we got pretty decent sized mana now. And this has just been outside. So this doesn't do anything. Um, but yeah, so we'll be playing around with this a lot more. Because there's one thing that I really, really, um, let's see, really want to make. And it's this little guy right here. Starfield Cluster. Um, it's some Elementium ingots and pixie dust. And yeah, this is... If you like pretty, you're going to like that. But guys, guys, give me one second. I'm going to see if we got enough time. Because there's some stuff I want to do. But I can't do it if I don't got no time. So uh, give me one second and I'll be right back. Did you guys just check the time to see <laughs> how long we've been playing for? Yeah, so did I. And uh, unfortunately, guys, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to have enough time. I really don't. So... Then we're going to call it an episode, guys. What do you guys think? Did you guys enjoy the episode? I uh, hope you did. hope you did, because I did. I did. And um, I think I'm going to like this gardening craft stuff. Or, sorry. Sorry. Sorry, mod developer. This garden container mod. Yeah. This should be fun. I just got to play around with it a little bit more. And I'll show you guys some more cool stuff we can do with it. Because I know those little container things um, that we have over at the house. Yeah, I know those things are going to be super helpful once we get it working. And, um, yeah. So, guys, guys, I know you guys don't want it to end, but it has to end sometime. So, uh, might as well know, right? Right. So, guys, if you did enjoy the episode, make sure you take two seconds, go down there and smash that like button, right? Because it lets me know that you guys are enjoying this series and it gives me all kinds of motivation to keep making you guys videos. And if you're new, to my series or this video and uh, you want to know when the next video is coming out uh, best way to do it is uh, go down there and subscribe yep we'll wait we'll wait and guys guys we got all kinds of fun stuff coming up like that mine shaft let's see if I can make it down to the mine shaft ow okay yeah that we're gonna be working on that tomorrow or next episode or whenever this next video comes out but for now guys that's gonna do it I'm Dizzy Aaron and I am out.